okay we have to prove that 1020 dot 1040 dot 1080 equals to root under 3 so before going to the problem let us recall the formula of 10 theta 10 theta is sine theta by cos theta so in place of theta if you write here 20 degree we have to write sine 20 by cos 20 degree so 1020 will be sine 20 by cos 20 so in place of 1020 we are going to write sine 20 by cos 20 so similarly in place of 1040 we will write sine 40 by cos 40 like in the same manner in place of 1080 we will write sine 80 by cos 80 now we will put them all together and we will multiply numerator by 2 and also denominator by 2 now let me revise it one more time in place of 1020 we wrote here sine 20 by cos 20 1040 sine 40 by cos 40 1080 sine 80 by cos 80 degree and we put them together and multiply numerator by 2 and also denominator by 2 the purpose of multiplying numerator and denominator by 2 is to make it applicable for the use of formula so let us write sine 20 by cos 20 as it is and let us use the formula of 2 sin a sin b we will assume 40 to be a and 80 to be b and then it will be 2 sin a sin b and the formula for 2 sin a sin b is cos a minus b minus cos a plus okay, b okay 2 cos a cos As b 40 is can be a seen in the denominator is so b. we are so going two to sin use a sin the b formula of 2 cos a cos b and the formula is cos a plus b plus cos a minus b 40 is a and it is b so we'll write sine 20 by cos 20 as it is and now we are going to substitute the value cos 40 minus 80 is uh, cos minus 40 and cos minus 40 is cos 40 degree so similarly cos 40 cos m 40 plus 80 gives you 120 and then in in the denominator we have cos 40 plus 80 is 120 plus cos 40 minus 80 is minus 40 and cos minus 40 is cos 40 degree so we will have to multiply with sine 20 and cos 40 degree plus minus sine 20 degree into cos 120 degree so we multiplied sine 20 in the by sine 20 in the numerator now we'll multiply by cos 20 in the denominator so when you multiply we will get cos 20 into cos 120 cos 20 into cos 40 degree now we all know the numeric value of cos 120 degree the numeric value of cos 120 degrees minus 1 by 2 so we'll substitute that value so we'll have sine 20 into cos 40 degree minus sine 20 and the cos value of cos 120 degrees minus 1 by 2 now we'll do the same thing in the denominator as well so in the denominator we have cos 20 and the numeric value of cos 20, 120 degrees minus 1 by 2 plus cos 20 dot cos 40 degree so in this step we substitute the value of cos 120 degree now let us further solve it We'll write sine 20 dot cos 40 minus into minus gives you plus sine 21 is sine 20 and in the denominator you have 2 so now we'll come to the denominator cos 20 into minus 1 gives you minus cos 20 the denominator being 2 plus cos 20 dot cos 40 degree now we'll take an LCM and simplify so we expect you all know to simplify 2 into sine 20 cos 40 gives you 2 sine 20 dot cos 40 degree plus sine 20 remains as it is by 2 again now in the denominator also we do the same thing we have to write minus cos 20 degree as it is and then take an LCM so minus cos 20 degree plus 2 into cos 20 cos 40 gives you 2 cos 20 dot cos 40 degree by 2 now we can cancel 2 and 2 and let us write what will be left after that we have 2 sin 20 cos 40 as a form in the form of formula it looks like 2 sin a cos b so we'll use the formula of 2 sin a cos b here the formula is sin a plus b plus sin a minus b and we'll write sin 20 as it is 
now in the denominator also let us write minus cos 20 as it is and then we have 2 cos a cos b something like in the formula structure of 2 cos a cos b 2 cos 20 cos 40 is presumed to be 2 cos a cos b so we have to use the formula the formula is cos a minus b minus cos a plus b now we'll sum the number and we'll write it so now cos sine will remain sine and 20 plus 40 gives you 60 plus sine 20 minus 40 gives you minus 20 in fact so we'll write here minus 20 degree plus sine 20 degree as it is by in the denominator you have minus cos 20 degree plus cos 20 minus 40 is cos uh, 20 minus 40 is minus 20 and cos minus 20 is cos 20 degree because we know cos minus theta is cos theta minus cos 20 plus 40 is 60 degree okay now here we put the sum it looks like by mistake we had a wrong formula the formula for 2 cos a cos b is cos a minus b plus cos a plus b so we by so it will be plus here 2 cos a cos b is cos a minus b plus cos a plus b i mistakenly write here wrote minus earlier so that is plus in in fact so now sine 60 is sine 60 we'll keep it same sine minus 20 is minus sine 20 degree plus sine 20 degree by minus cos 20 degree plus cos 20 degree gets cancelled and we have cos 60 degree minus sine 20 plus 20 cancels and you have 10 60 degree which is equals to root 3 so this is how we solve the problem not that complicated problem in fact